So the radiation therapy program here at Labore, it's a two-year commitment. It's a very strong commitment. The clinical portion of it is two days a week starting right away. So you go right into the clinical setting immediately. It's two days a week for the entire semesters during the actual school year. And then in the summertime, it's done 40 hours a week in the clinic. So we're very, very heavy in our clinical component, which is a great part of our program because that's what you're going to be doing when you actually graduate. So you're more prepared to go out there into the field of radiation therapy and be able to just take off and treat the patients the way you need to be. During the program, we move our students to six different centers. Uh, we do this just to make them more of a well-rounded therapist so that we're able to give them different equipment as well as give them different clinical instructors that are each at each center have different strengths and weaknesses just as well as the students do. They also provide different opportunities as far as um, what types of cancers they treat at their centers. So a radiation therapist treats cancer patients. They follow a prescription that's done by a radiation oncologist. Every day you're, you treat the same patient Monday through Friday five days a week um, for around six to eight weeks, depending on what type of cancers they have. We use a machine called a linear accelerator. The linear accelerator produces high energy x-rays that we use to treat and target tumor cells. In order to do that, we do have to treat healthy cells within the body as well, but the healthy cells, the whole goal is that they'll regenerate and the tumor cells won't. What we would be looking for for a radiation therapist for a candidate into our program would be somebody that was highly compassionate and empathetic towards any patient or any person that was in need. It's really important that you're able to read people and decide what it is that that patient actually needs from you in that day. And you're willing to deal with things that sometimes are sad and then sometimes they're really happy and glorious at the end of the day. But you're gonna have that mix, so you have to be able to deal with both. We work in teams of two all the time in radiation therapy. And when you're doing that, you have to work within millimeters of accuracy. So you really have to be able to take constructive criticism from your partner very well. And you have to gain the trust of not only your partner, but also the patient during that treatment. If you don't have the trust of your patient while you're trying to treat them, they're not going to be able to stay still and do the things that you need them to be able to do in order to give them the proper treatment. So the biggest part is really you helping them know that they're not alone, that we're in this together, that we're going to fight it together. And that's what makes a good radiation therapist.